Now, ready to get started? Let's start with a very simple question. I, I ask uh, very simple questions, and none of them are trick questions, I promise you, throughout this. So what is your job? Well, your primary job is to inspire your staff to behave in ways that further the mission and vision of your organization. So there's a great story about uh, John Kennedy, right, who makes this outrageously bold uh, statement that we're going to put a man on the moon. And he visits NASA and he shakes hands and he comes to this one gentleman and he says, what do you do here? What's your job? And the man says, to put a man on the moon. Now it turns out that he was a janitor. But he really got it, right? He really got that what everybody was doing there and what he was doing there, and I really appreciated the comment this morning about emphasizing understanding how your role fits in, right? A piece of the pie, like the difference that you make. So I should ask, if I ask anybody in this organization, what is your job, right? From the security guard um, to the folks in this room to the folks who work perhaps in the kitchen um, or maintenance, your job right, is to provide high quality, accessible, and affordable educational opportunities and services, including university transfer, technical, and lifelong learning programs that promote individual development and improve the overall quality of life in a multicultural community. That is your job. By the way, love the mission statement. Okay? One of the things that I like to do is when I walk into organizations, um, oh, by the way, I should tell you this up front. When I talk, I get these intrusive thoughts sometimes, and I found a long time ago it was better to just share those, okay, <laughs> instead of trying to suppress them. So um, I was recently um, at a veterinarian's office um, with our beloved cat, and walk in, and it's this amazing facility. And the first thing that I'm met with, right, on the wall, it, big letters on the wall, is what their mission statement is. And their mission statement was around the kind of difference that they make, right, for families, right, and, and keeping their pets safe and, and well and healthy and all that. Like, that is so great, right? Because as a customer, and you have customers, right, your students are actually your customers, um, and you have visitors, yes. So when they come in and they see this hopefully prominently displayed, and every one of you comes into work every day, you're really reminded why you're here and what's important. And that's really, really important, right? Because on a day-to-day -day basis, we get into the grind, right? We get into frustration. So if we're reminded every day, um, I make this recommendation to all organizations, and, and one in particular, a large pharmaceutical company that I really appreciate, is as soon as you walk in the building, there are these large pictures, right? These large signs that talk about the lives that they save every day, right? The difference that they're making in the world. And again, you all make an incredible difference in the world, and we want to keep people focused on that. Mission is the common denominator for everybody in this organization. And whenever we have issues and problems, it's always good to bring people back to the table. Yesterday, I was working with uh, uh, a local uh, polytech um, uh, vocational school, um, the union and the staff are really, and leadership are some really disagreement. So when we come to the table, what I want to focus, what can we agree on? What can we agree on is that we're here um, for the students and around their mission statement.